Solving for the x, we have the x on the left hand side, but the x has an 8 and a y on the same side that it's on. So ultimately we're going to have to get rid of those two. Rewriting the 8x minus y equals z, we can start off by moving any of the terms that don't have an x away from the side that has the x. So in this case we've got a minus y on the left hand side. We can move that entire term by doing the opposite which is adding y to the left hand side. Now if I add y to the left I have to also add y to the right to keep the two equal and then on the left the y's are going to cancel. So I still have the 8 and the x on the left hand side of the equation and on the right hand side the z plus y those are not like terms so I'm just going to rewrite that as z plus y. No simplification that I can do there. And then finally we also need to get rid of the 8. So on the left hand side of the equation the 8 and the x are being multiplied. I want to undo multiplication so I need to use division. I'm going to divide the left hand side by 8 and to do that I need to also divide the entire right hand side by 8. Then on the left hand side the 8's are going to cancel. The 8 on the top cancels the 8 on the bottom. I'm left with still the x but now the x is by itself. That's what I was shooting for. On the right hand side no simplification can be done there. I've got a complex fraction with a z plus y in the top and an 8 in the bottom and since it doesn't simplify my answer is complete.